my niggas, my niggas get out. I guess the boss is in the house, holding weight like elephants stomping out of house. Yeah, my pockets on fat. Your boy started young, K Street with a sack. I started guns, 34 with a pack. With a pack, Lincoln Park, mug them, beat them till they black. Till they black. I'm taking home plate, cause they know me. I'm from the ground up, that's no below me. I'm never boasting, I'm never bragging. But when I'm owning, that's so below me. So what you see in is what I believe in. This gangster is death of prison. I'm on 23rd, I'm on 25th, I'm from 34th, I'm with some more Crips, we on Portland Ave. What's up world, Ahab Washington, we at the 2015 event in Seattle, Washington, make some noise. Yeah! I'm one of your hosts today, Let's I'm 206, it. on my right we got Young Nate. Young Nate, Money Gang, Portland, Ahab Northwest, we all in the building, I'm gonna let you introduce yourself. It's D.L. Murray, let's not wait any longer. On my left, we got Heretic. Yo, what up? Heretic, Form C's, Burn C's, Olympia, Ahab Washington, MC on my left. Introduce yourself. It's improv, just like he said. Let's get this shit in. Let's get going. Yep. All right. Since you, uh, DL, since you're on my right, you're going to call it in there. All right. Tails. It's Tails. Oh, oh big DL nuts. Oh! Uh-oh. <laughs> All right. Get on one. Another rapper with a shitty name. <laughs> this time it's improv. Another rapper about to get three yo then claim that he's been robbed. You ain't gonna be ready when I come at you with an unhinged jaw. Murray ending your career like this was Glen Gary, Glenn Ross. Improv, you look like a Nimrod whose brain probably don't spin cogs. Breath smelling like you just finished giving Send Dog a rim job. You, you been loud and you been bombing. Have you ever caught a wind dog? Your highest aspiration is a disappointment to some in-laws. These cats you've been setting me up against got me in mental anguish. Why the fuck am I up here battling English as a second language? Looking like you skipped your retention deficit medication. You need to get the F out, World Wrestling Federation. Find a better place to invest with your vexating presence. I've had about enough of these treasure chest raiding peasants taking precious space up just to let out some misplaced aggression. To say it best, your level of dedication raises questions. It's too plain to me to see that you ain't an MC. You act all gassed up, but your tank is empty. Improv is on E. What you need to do is improve. I don't mean to intrude, but you seem a bit too wet behind the ears. Just an inexperienced youth. I can make you disappear in a very quick poof. I said, improv is on E. But I don't mean that he's on a roll, not even honorable mention down at the bottom of the honor roll. The fact that you and I share a common goal is just comical. For me, it makes sense. For you, it's just irresponsible. Too unintelligent, out of his element, I have seen you battle. You need to come with better shit. The fundamental dilemma is that I am a mic specialist. You might just want to make your bones crunch like kettle chips. Wait a minute. Hold up. Hit him with the whole punch. Mom and dad are about to be missing him a whole bunch. Bagged up, cold lunch. Homie, you've been told once. You made a date with death and that bitch likes to go Dutch. Round one. Make some noise. Yo, to be honest, I'm not happy in this position. I'm forced to drop my morals, my standards, my goals, and cause affliction. But it's a sacrifice I'll make to show y'all that I'm gifted because I'm focused on a body like a coroner's ambition. See, three rounds to cook him. You'll need a Hail Mary and saving grace. So don't you dare gas him up because I'm already giving this pro pain. But shit, we can put it on the table. Guide his ego to the ground. Drop bars and keep him on the DL like I don't want them to get around. So whatever faith you got, I got my own version of hell, an American psycho that can make any Christian bail shit. And if I cock my hand back, I'll turn this small bitch into a tiny issue. You look like you read Fifty Shades of Grey with lotion and tissue, but shit. <laughs> Yo, but let's cut to the chase. You've been writing since you were eight, so I'm expecting a clean look to get the scene shook in a nice presentation, but I started writing last year, so obviously someone held out a low expectation. This is fluid imagery. You losing instantly. You choosing and using a useless efficiency while I'm inducing and using a ruthless symphony. It probably took you nine months to give birth to those bars literally, because I see sections of you with the force delivery. So if you dedicate a round that says I'm a biter, that says nothing about my ability, but how you fondle with inconsistency and float and predictability. Mm. Time. Make some noise. Oh, Round two. DL, it's on you. 
I just hope you can control your emotions. I know you're jealous, but get overzealous and I throw bows like cellists. You show no development. You show no development. I don't mean to piss in your cocoa pebbles, but you don't even have what it takes to be known on a local level. You spend half a round rapping to a beat that isn't playing, then mid-sentence just forget how to keep rhythm and cadence. Stumble through some bars trying to get your energy back, then you get really mad and your voice trembles and cracks till it resembles a quack. Don't even act like that's any less than a fact. At the last event you was at, I caught you dead in the act. You disrespected every last aspect of the craft, so I'll take some corrective action on our collective behalf. Did Santa Claus come through with a trimmer up in his sack of toys? How in the fuck are your eyebrows gonna be trapezoids? Your fashion choices are like some kind of broke ass backstreet boy four years after the contract was void. You have got the wackest voice. Your flow's whack and your lyrics whack. You look like a JC Penny young men's department clearance rack. After the after this battle, watch him go and pull a disappearing act. I'll put a flat bill on your head. I ain't talking about a new era cap. When I hear him rap, it only confuses me. You think you're sick? Watch me cure disease like my name was Susan G. You are soon to be cartoonishly disfigured for your buffoonery. When I snap your legs in half, they gon' call this the battle of wounded knee. Fair fight? You and me? Yeah, right. Lunacy. When they see your name on the flyers, they're like, who is he? Just some scrappy young pup who's in need of a new to ring, but so just because you act a little nuts, it doesn't prove a thing. You a straight D student who couldn't afford tutoring and still needs assistance if you want to put on shoes with strings. I can see that rapping doesn't bring you the joy it used to bring when you was just a kid being encouraged to pursue your dreams. Well, here you are now. Your friends and family do not appear to notice. I ain't taking no more battles against these bottom tier opponents. I can see you sweating. I got it too hot in here to focus. I got one round left for you, then the top is where I go next. Make some noise. Round two. In front. Yo, see, I can't dismiss that your punches are cynical little hits. But they're pretty easy to brush off when they're set from an awkward looking little bitch. Damn. Yo, so besides your sexual orientation, let's get something straight before them 20 rounds are finished. You only brought your A game because my talent pushed you to those limits. But now, this is knockout in a prize fight with far more than basic hits. You'll tear up at the sight of a ring on some engagement shit. You don't think I figured out your style, how you how you somehow managed to rap off beat, how you recycle similar concepts, then rinse and repeat? I don't know, Dio Murray. They saw you as a threat, but to me that's not permissible because a good enemy will focus on deception not being so fucking predictable example. You're gonna have a bunch of one-liners on how I'm a dumb rhymer as well as a bum writer whose flow has been done tired. So I suggest we step it up, cause I'm seeing some shaky tactics, but you rely on that one line worse than a fucking coke habit. Let's incorporate setups, schemes, shit. Maybe then we'll start seeing prices, entendres, metaphors, literary devices. So go ahead, D.L. Murray, throw a punch. It's about that time. Mine explosive from the ground up when I land. Mine. But now you in a, you in a lost path, so you better watch your step. I'm going to squeeze your fucking neck till you got no fucking vitals left. But now this is just part of the cipher. I got the heart of a fighter because I'm a lyrical sniper and I'm a fucking survivor. This is heavyweight. His bars are much lighter. Now step your fucking game up and start being a better writer. Wow. All I see in you is some pipe dreams that you feel the need to All I see in you is some pipe dreams that you feel the need to validate. But when I proceed to salivate, your heart cease to palpitate. Increase fatality rates. I'm a beast without debate. But from the first minute they release me out the gate. When I GG Allen stages MCs leave mouths agate. Get the fuck back to the bench. Lyrically, he's out of shape. And since we're both 90s kids, I think it's sufficient to say that you want some Hey Arnold shit, cause you don't fit into A hat. You a gimmick, a stage act. I'm spitting this straight facts. I'm spitting this straight facts. Only time you talk to women is when he's getting his legs waxed. You been a bitch since the minute the egg hatched. You wouldn't swing, you don't make hits, you just play catch. He'll feel... <laughs> he will, he'll exhibit dismay as the tip of the blade slashes way through the layers to keep the ligaments attached. 
They'll give the max sentence to my sick and depraved ass for committing such strange acts. Consider paid back for making me have to sit through that last battle with T. James. By the third, I could see pee stains in your jeans on the freeze frame. You couldn't master rap if your name was D. Sane, and now you up here being defamed by someone who ain't even aiming to achieve fame. Nah, I do the shit just to appeal to my sadistic side. I put a loss on your record just to listen in while you piss and whine. Your aspirations and your capabilities are misaligned. This is what it sounds like when a real MC spits a rhyme. You ain't serving no one, homie. You don't even serve a purpose. Every time that you open your mouth, a turd emerges. I'll leave you curled up in the corner. I'll, I'll leave you hurled up in the corner, curled up like words in cursive. You'll be looking like such a mangled mess, it'll look like you're an invertebrate. Merciless when I'm murking and murdering. When I put my savagery to work, he'll get flattened beneath the curtains. You just had to be a burden. I ain't even mean to beat him that bad, but he deserved it. Glad I could be of service. Make some noise. Oh. Make some noise. Oh. round three. Yo, round three, and between just you and me, there's no longer any room to breathe. So quick on my moving feet, the start of your losing streak. Peaceful I used to be, get lost in my fluency, see your A-hat. This is how you write a fucking eulogy. See, I, see, I know what terror is. I'm cold as ice is, a known terrorist, cold as ice is. So please, aim less and leave, cause you lost in the abyss walking aimlessly. I can see past that gimmick, so hopefully that buzz will soon begin to decrease. So call me a clumsy stoner, cause I'm packing fire, and then I'm breaking the peace. You use shock value as a crutch, which allows you to spark some interest. Cause when y'all see a nerdy white boy make a bummy appearance, mediocre bars might go the extra distance. So let's work in our presentation and actually portray some confidence. Let's ditch the one syllable rhyme you learned from Hooked on Phonics. Uh. Bitch, empathy is my enemy. I lack morals and equity. Nice tendencies to slice legacies like bisectomies. Murder is my specialty, so let me say this cool calm collectively. Battle rap doesn't want you, it doesn't need you. And I mean that shit respectfully. But if you want to go clip a clip, I can show you what I mean technically. So, so I suggest, yeah, who wants? So I suggest you don't speak, cause you officially at arm's reach. I'm making an impact when him and my palm meet. See, now you fucked up, stuck in a corner in a tricky situation, cause you undermine all your opponents, and now you'll get hit with blows of devastation. You know this shit too well. A prescription for pain, you'll know the pharmacy very well Cause I'll get that right aid when these bars sell And I'll paint my Walgreens when the money does what the bar tells